Michael Carter is a running back out of UNC that I loved for the Jets at either 66 or 86 in the 2021 NFL Draft. After they traded up for Elijah Vera Tucker, I didn't think it would be possible for them to land him. The fact that Joe Douglas got him at 107 in the fourth round is incredible value. Honestly believe that Michael Carter can be a starter for the Jets and an impactful player from day one, helping Zach Wilson end this offense. What makes him such an impactful player? Well, let's have a look at the film. In the first clip here, what we're emphasizing is elite change of direction, uh, the ability to bend and ankle flexion, change direction quickly in a foam booth, and that lateral agility. You're going to see the linebacker crashing here, and you're going to really emphasize Carter's uh, quicks in space, short area quickness, all of those things that make a running back so difficult to bring down. And that's how he breaks tackles. It isn't through speed uh, to power or conversion like a Derrick Henry or a Najee Harris. It's his elusiveness. His vision as well, the vision to see the linebacker, to cut and plant off that right leg, how quickly and sharply he cuts, gets north-south again, and then bounces outside with that burst to the pylon. Really impressive prey by Michael Carter, and that really is who he is as a player. Second one here in the red zone, out of shotgun again, again against Boston College. And he's going to be running left like he will be a lot for the New York Jets behind Mackay Becton and AVT. This time, the right defensive end is going to crash. He's going to identify that good vision again, cut off his left, back towards the center of the pocket, and then accelerate and burst north-south through that hole. A lot of one cuts might not be as north-south as the San Francisco offense, but love his ability to change direction on a dime. So elusive and quick with his movements. Oh, it's impressive. And then the burst to get through that hole and nearly take it for seven. Love that from Michael Carter. This play against Virginia is all about vision. In the wide zone offense, you're going to be reading D to C to B, understanding where your gap is and then accelerating through it. This isn't that kind of play, but it showcases Michael Carter's vision in general. He identifies that there's a secondary player blitzing, points that out to his quarterback, and then has the understanding of how to get to where he wants to go. So he understands that he doesn't want to run into the blitz, but he wants to still cut back to his right, goes deeper into the pocket before he cuts off his left foot, finds that gap in the, in the A gap, and then takes it vertically and turns into a 40-yard run. That could have been a negative play, but he had the understanding, the vision, and then the patience to wait for his lane, follow his blocks, and then accelerate again. He's got bigger play potential than a lot of the, the uh, running backs early in the draft outside of Travis Etienne, Etienne, really like this ability from Michael Carter. And this is what's going to make him an excellent fit for the wide zone. This play here is just about patience. So again, out of shotgun, you're going to see that a lot in UNC, waiting for that hole to develop, not trying to outrun his blocks, and then burst, acceleration, and finishing over his pads. He's a smaller back. He's a speed back who's going to be good on third down. But watch how he finishes this run, breaks contact, gets over his pads and finishes. Really impressive. And the thing that's going to allow him to be a three-down player in conjunction with his pass-catching ability is his blocking. Here in pass protection, you're going to see a stunt where the right defensive end is going to twist inside and attack the inside shoulder of the left guard. The guard gets way too involved with the defensive end, sorry, the defensive tackle, and it's up to Carter to step in and save the play. Does a really good job identifying it. His vision's good, pad level's excellent, and keeps his quarterback clean. So that's Michael Carter, a player that is fantastic value for the Jets at 107. Loved the pick, can be a day one starter thanks to his change of direction, elusiveness, lateral quickness, and then his pass catching and blocking on third down. Michael Carter, great selection from Joe Douglas and Co.